She speaks facts. You guys are so stupid. You're stupid. If you believe her, you're dumb. I don't know how to say that any other way. You are dumb. The only reason I don't like FFG is because she fucking has a- she is obsessed. If you people don't see that, she has a problem with my relationship, but she's the one making up lies and making it fucking worse. Okay, so all this, I'm just doing it because I love you. You're a domestic abuse victim. But you fucking exploit it. You're a piece of shit. And I don't care how fucking fat you are. You're a piece of shit. Only because she's talking about me, Adina. That's the only reason. She's streaming my content. And there's 2.5k. It's not her content. She's a friggin' idiot. Oh, here we go. Block. Block. See ya. Bye. Anyone else want to come in here? Bye. Bye. No? You guys are morons. You're listening to a fucking liar who's probably also on drugs. Bye. Who else do I have to block? Veronica. Bye. Bye. All her tater tards are coming in here. Bye. She is an asshole and she's a fucking bitch. So, bye. And she's a liar. A big liar. And you're all stupid for believing her. But that's your choice, I guess. I'm just going to uh, block everybody. I feel like adding mods again. Do you think I should? I don't give a fuck if you think I'm a bad person. Tater tards. I'll say it if I want. Then get the fuck out of here. Bye. Who else? I have a gun and I'm still more beautiful. So you'll never get me there. Bye. See you. 2.5k in her chat. Why? Because of me, you fucking moron. You think anyone cares what you have to say? Nobody gives a shit what you have to say. Yes, people do give a shit. That's why there are 2.5k in her chat, moron. The only reason I don't like FFG is because she fucking has a- she is obsessed. If you people don't see that, she has a problem with my relationship, but she's the one making up lies and making it fucking worse. Okay, so all this, I'm just doing it because I love you. You're a domestic abuse victim. But you fucking exploit it. You're a piece of shit. And I don't care how fucking fat you are. You're a piece of shit. No, Chantal makes everything worse by coming on live, talking about Dom consistently, worrying her members by giving them a safe word. Like, are you kidding me? Peeking out the window over and over to see if he's going to show up. Just the other night, she was like, oh, I shouldn't be talking about him. He's going to get so mad. FFG is just reacting to what you put out. She speaks facts. You guys are so stupid. You're stupid. If you believe her, you're dumb. I don't know how to say that any other way. You are dumb. So Chantal has yet to come out with any of these so-called lies. French fried girls. French fried girl has supposedly been saying, but every stream we hear, oh, she's such a liar. You guys believe her. You're morons. Where's the lie, though? Lauren, go fuck yourself. I'm not even talking about Dom. I'm not talking about Dom. I'm here making fucking brownies. So why is she still talking about it? Because she has no content. She's an idiot. Bye, Randall. Go fuck yourself. You people are ridiculous. Like, you're believing lies. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You people are fucking idiots. 
because you're back with him. How do you fucking know that? How do you fucking know that? How do you fucking know that? <laughs> you don't know that. Jesus Christ. I'm here on fucking live stream. I'm not over there. Right? I'm here. Yes, I need to smoke because I'm going to fucking lose it. She lies to you and get up because you want drama. Because you hate me. <sighs> Karate Joe. Ad moderator. Go block on a fucking blocking spree. Who else? No, too bad, Mia. Okay, I'm sick of this shit. I'm sick of it. You don't like it? I don't care. Krista. Mod. Who else? Abby, Andreas, all oh, fuck yourself, Monica, Rusty, Tiffany Brown, <laughs> no, no fucking, oh my god, I, oh my god, I, instead of modding Andreas, I, hold on Andreas, who did I block, add moderator, Rusty Spoons, unhide, add moderator, Monica, unhide, add moderator. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so used to blocking people. Abby Flounders, unhide, add moderator. Um, thank you very much. Every single, these people are parasites. Every time I go live, I want to go live. And then they fucking attach themselves like par they're parasites. It's just so annoying. Right. For me? Yeah, I don't even like people I know get in my business. I know. French fried girl, French fried hurl. Yeah, I'm always live. I know. Just make sure. Whenever you guys delete people, it's like really just like you know what I mean. Like things you know would annoy me. It's gonna be boring, I know, but. <sighs> reported Frenchie to YouTube. Actually, I think I'm going to report her for copyright infringement. If Callie can do it, then I'm gonna fucking do it. How about that? Yeah, okay, pumpkin head. Fucking moron. Honestly, her her fans that like they're all my haters. How 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 amazing in life are you gonna be? Like seriously. Is she really going to act like she didn't have haters until FFG came along? She's only been reacting to Chantel for a couple of months, so it doesn't really add up. Beth, oh, I'm glad to block you. Fuck you. Bye. It's only a matter of time. Like, what is she going to do? Like, make a good channel out of her shitty content? Give me a break. Well, anything would be better than the mess you think is content, Chantel. Coming on stream, worrying your audience, then the next day acting like everything's fine and you're not in danger. How many Beezers have you lost at this point because they're just fed up? Yeah, right. More amazing in life. Sure. The only reason you people watch her is because she fucking talks about me. The only reason. Yeah. Okay. Latasha, I don't know how, but it took social media break. I've been watching Chantel. I wouldn't give her a view. She's bashing someone for views, Chantel. I wouldn't even acknowledge them. Love you, Chantal. Exactly, Latasha. She has to bash people for views. Exactly. Just imagine not seeing Chantal's content for the past few months and then deciding to tune in. It would be a shit show. Everyone can have their own opinion, including that Latasha girl. But the truth is, people don't like what Chantal has been displaying the past few months. They don't support it. We're just pointing it out. It's very toxic and damaging behaviors. And just so you know, there's screenshots of her talking about her domestic, her fucking domestic abuser or whatever in a very loving way. So why don't you go and fucking give her shit for uh, making light of domestic abuse? Okay, how about that? As I'm editing this right now, it's almost been two days since Chantel streamed this stream and there is still no proof of the screenshot she's talking about. So, okay, Chantel. Let's see. I'm going to get those screenshots. I did too? 
No, I didn't. Yes, you do. Literally every time you go back to Dom, you worry your supporters. You have left and then you give them hope that you will leave for good. All the toxic things associated with him. And then the next day, it's like everything is fine. You defend everything. Make it seem like you were actually in the wrong. That's making light of abuse and it's manipulation. Bye, TJ. See you. Max, bye. See you later, Max. I don't care if they go to her channel. Good. Bye. You guys can go. Booty beauty. So just like, how long after you trashed on Dom did you go back? I'm not talking about that. It's my business. Why not talk about something else? I agree. People want to act like they never do drugs. I know. Rochelle. If you're not going to answer any questions, what's the point? I am answering questions. Just ones I want to answer. Who else do I have to hide? Who's being mean? Let's be like, let's just be fucking positive. He is very abusive. I'm not modding him. Oh, my family doesn't want me around? Yeah, so you feel that it's okay to harass them, right? My family loves me and I don't care. There's no amount of drugs I'm going to try that's going to make them not love me. I do inhale. Another stupid thing that sh that friggin' moron said with the side ponytail. Why do you guys, how can you even s stand to watch her? Look at her. This kind of makes me laugh because Chantal has said that she doesn't inhale when she smokes weed because she was trying to make it seem like not a big deal that she drove after smoking because she didn't inhale. But now she's switching it up again, I guess. <laughs> Who gives a shit how much I inhale? Oh, it's only Jody. What's the point of my lives? What's the point of watching her lives of my lives? Let's just give shit to everybody. Another broken promise. Oh, well, I guess you don't need to be here then. Speaks the truth. You're an idiot for believing that. She has a personality. <laughs> oh, my God. That's the funniest thing I ever heard in my life. Chrissy knows it all. Goodbye. If she, you didn't go live, she wouldn't have content. Exactly. I'm going to talk to my freaking YouTube manager about this. This is ridiculous. How do these people listen to this moron just make up lie after lie after lie? And she encourages fucking abuse shaming. Does Stabby still hit you? Koki? What kind of fucking bullshit is that? You people are fucking sick. And I'm blocking all of you. I'm sick of this shit. I want to go back to fucking positive frigging live streams. When has it ever been positive? When beezing and eating her weight and olives and cheese isn't positive, ma'am. I will be reporting her. I'm gonna like t I'm I'm gonna take the time to actually like write my case. I'm not even gonna talk about it. I'm not I'm not gonna say what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna do it and the day will come. I honestly really doubt that Chantel is so lazy, let's be honest. It took her how many months to block everyone her and her mods blocked over the past years for literally nothing. And she only did it because she probably thought she would get some paid memberships. I can guarantee that. Disgusting. I'm disgusting the shit she says and the people in her fucking chat. Go look at the chat right now. Yeah, I do do drugs. Weed. It's illegal here. Do you take anything for pain? That's even worse. She sucks as a fucking DV survivor, and I don't sit here and, and cry and be like, I'm only going to interfere in your life because I care about you. What, full of shit. That's a fucking lie. Do you believe, you believe that, though? You believe that? She, she thinks she's being righteous? <sighs> if you guys remember what happened, I want to say about a month ago, Chantel and FFG had a phone conversation. Chantel said not to speak about the phone conversation on YouTube. And French fried girl didn't, and then Chantel broke her word, so. People are just projecting onto you. I know, obviously. It's so obvious. It's just annoying that people can't see it. How are people being worried projecting onto you? Some comments are vile and uncalled for about Chantel's looks or whatever. Yes, I agree with that, obviously. 
but that's nothing new, and a lot of the comments are not that at all. Especially people who are giving her, just the other night, lists of reasons why she should leave Dom and why her life would be better without him. So, of course they're going to be upset. Please stop being so mean. Please go to members only if you can't contain your emotions. I'm not being mean. Am I being mean? Haley, I don't need brownies. Neither do you. Can you explain what are the lies? No, Chrissy, I can't. I don't feel like talking about her. <clears throat> uh, she's profiting. She's a single way female. You're just acting cocky. No, I'm acting cocky because people are pissing me off. I came on live to talk to my friggin' fans. Not to be abused. Shut up, Nikita. Fuck. You don't know what I'm doing with my family, so shut up. How about that? There's just vile people in there. That's what I'm saying. That's all her friggin' chat is, is idiots who are obsessed with me. She thinks like, ooh, look at I have such a big chat. Just because I'm talking about Chantel, so I better do it. Like, how do you, like, even, how are you even proud of your channel when that's what your content is? Like, <sighs> anyway. Spreading awareness about abuse is something to be proud of. I know I'm proud of it. This is my first video. You guys are hearing me talk, really, but I will be getting more into why Chantel's content is so triggering to me when it comes to the whole dom situation waking up at 4 p.m and having two nashies for breakfast is however not something to be proud of and correct me if i'm wrong but when ffg says she's gonna upload she does it Chantel has been saying for months that she's gonna come out with live or er, main channel videos not live streams and we've gotten a few poor excuses for main channel videos so yeah and julia you can suck dick too Yes, I did. Okay, Kels, then bye. I don't know what to say. That's where you draw the line? Okay, that's nice. Bye, Care Bear. <laughs> yes, I'm proud of my channel. Bye, Rebecca. Bye, Kels. See ya. Elena, bye. <sighs> so what? They are being our words, okay? In a figurative sense. I don't care. I'm sick of that. Like, if I say something out of anger, people just, like, hold it against me, like, forever. You know what I mean? Everyone used to say the R word. Everyone's offended by everything these days. Everything. I'm, I'm sick of, like, worrying about what I say. I'm, I'm so fucking over it. I'm sick of this shit. Seriously. Ugh. They've said a lot worse. They've said a lot worse. I don't even want to hear it. Hate me for saying it all you want. I don't give a shit. Yeah, antagonizing. Exactly. Well, no, I'm not saying that he is, but... Anyways, I don't want to talk about fuck. Like, why is this, like, all it's become? Like, I told you I don't want to talk about it. Because Dom is pretty much all you talk about anymore. And you have no self-control on ignoring comments about him and your members are worried because of what you have told everyone about dom sharing my private life do you know how many fucking youtubers do that does that give you the right to go and write on my grandma's obituary does that give you the right to come to my house does that give you the right to call the cops does that give you the right to know every sing single thing i do in my life no it doesn't so if you can't handle that goodbye i'm not taking shit anymore Raging like this on live stream isn't going to make the haters stop digging into your personal life. It's going to make matters worse, if anything. And Chantel always says, oh, my family's used to it. We get ha harassed all the time from you guys. You would think she would know better not to make a public obituary about her grandmother. Something so serious like that. You would think she would want to keep it as private as possible, knowing her audience. And I'm not sure exactly even where the obituary is. I honestly think it might be on, like, a Facebook page or something. But people writing on it, that is not okay, like, at all. But, I mean, 
she should have kind of seen it coming considering how things are lately. People taking out their failures. Mermaid, my child is on the spectrum and I've never related the R word to her. Give me a break. You're the offensive one. People are just looking for... It's just fucking outrage for nothing. <clears throat> you know what I mean? That's seriously all you're going to say after you seriously offended someone with a child on the spectrum? Nice, Chantal. Disgusting. Oh, Sarah, go fuck yourself. Sarah, another Sarah, just, uh, bye. Uh, Alyssa, go fuck yourself. Um, who else do I have to tell to go fuck herself? Aurelia, I can't stand you. Well then, Vicky, go fuck yourself. Who else can I tell to go fuck myself, themselves? An honest question, does it hurt your feelings when people openly dislike the people you date? No, it doesn't hurt my feelings. I don't care, really. So you don't care that your mother loses sleep because you were seeing this man? Because you did say that the other night when you were done with Dom. Remember that, Chantel? Okay, great. You're trash. <laughs> FFG told Grain and Gown, Ground that her, his mother, like, has dementia to forget his ass. Like, she's a fucking lowlife piece of shit and every one of her supporters like queenish another lowlife piece of shit this idiot messages me on instagram calls me a fat cow and she looks like a fucking dumpling okay so please don't message me if you look like a dumpling and call me fat oh jay connor well you're probably a bigger train wreck that's why you're here bye <clears throat> he who blocked pookie did i block pookie i didn't block anybody she does not react to what comes out of my mouth. But go back there then. Rug, I'm fat. I don't care that they can shame all they want. Really, I don't really care. It doesn't hurt my feelings. It's just, I've, it's annoying that people come in here. Look, I don't have a problem with people calling me names. I don't have a problem. I've never come on here and cried and been like, oh, I see I look like an egg. Number one, because look at the source. Number two, that, that's the, my whole problem is the hypocrisy of these people. The, it's just they're hypocrites. Oh my God. Right from Cali fucking copyright claiming right after I got shit. How many times were people copyright claiming for me copyright claiming them when they actually use my content? But it's not okay for people to use your content, right? <laughs> that's exactly my problem. Hmm. FFG and Kelly don't even discuss Chantel's weight or anyone else they react to. They discuss their unhealthy habits. There's a difference. Some racist guy named Negs here on YouTube. I don't watch his shit. Uh, he uploaded Kelly's whole video. No changes or anything. No commentary added. So that's breaking the rules and you would think after years of being on youtube that foodie would know this but i guess she doesn't even know the rules and the video on Nex's channel was taken down so clearly callie was right so go ahead and try to strike channel chantelle but you might want to know the rules first i need serious help I need serious help because I catch bullshit, right? Is that why? She made fun of my hysterectomy. That bitch made fun of my hysterectomy, exactly. Now I'm supposed to have fucking sympathy for her. I think she's referring to Callie and I find it funny how she's saying all this but has no proof like always. Callie wished Amber Lynn the best when she had cancer and if anyone knows, Amberlynn is actually getting a lot of backlash for laughing in Negs' chat about Callie's infertility problems. So, just for a reference, if there's proof, why doesn't Chantel come out with it? FFG lives in a hotel room. I don't give a shit where she lives or that she, if she's poor. I mean, I'm not rich. She's just a friggin' asshole. That's all I care about. I just wanted her to leave me the fuck alone. You pay all the reaction channels their paychecks. 
And Berlin, too. Oh, Tara. You're going to uh, go fuck yourself, I see. Well, I tapped out there. I pretty much covered all of the big talking points. I felt like this rage stream was a pretty good way to ease myself into the commentary reactor side of things. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed my first kind of video like this. Hope you enjoy the rest of your week, and I'll catch you in my next video.